yes today concept is selenium web driver today concept is selenium web driver first already i told you once again i will repeat you selenium selenium is nothing but it is a software which contains some set of programs selenium is nothing but it is a software which contains some set of programs selenium having four components selenium having four components selenium having four components one is selenium id next selenium rc selenium web driver and the selenium grid selenium having four components selenium id selenium rc selenium web driver and selenium grid today concept first we will discuss about selenium id selenium id is nothing but it is a software selenium id is nothing but it is a software which contains some set of programs which contains some set of programs this set of programs we need to configure or we need to install into one user interface in the place of user interface we are using ide only so ide is a user interface no need to install somewhere no need to install somewhere why because if we want to interact with this programs compulsory we need to have one user interface in the place of user interface we are using ide ide is a user interface okay selenium ide advantages we have recording and playback facility we have recording and playback facility and the execution will be super fast execution will be super fast disadvantages we have recording and play by facility we have recording and playback facility and we can perform very limited testing we can perform very limited testing that's the reason none of the people not using nowadays selenium id selenium id getting deprecated selenium id getting deprecated id means integrated development environment selenium id is nothing but it is a software which contains some set of programs this set of programs we need to configure into one user interface in the place of user interface we are using id id is a user interface advantages we have recording and playback facility execution will be super fast disadvantages we have recording and playback facility and we can perform very limited testing using this selenium id we can perform very limited testing that's the reason none of the re none of the people not using selenium id in our days selenium id getting deprecated after that they made selenium rc after that they made selenium rc rc means remote control selenium rc is not what it is a software selenium rc is not what it is a software which contains some set of programs this set of programs we need to configure into one user interface in the place of user interface we are using eclipse we are using eclipse eclipse is not what it is a powerful editor to write the java programs eclipse is not what it is a powerful editor to write the java programs whenever you want to start with uh, whenever you want to work with uh, this selenium rc we need to start the server manually and we need to stop the server manually so using selenium rc also we can perform very limited testing that's the reason none of the people not using selenium rc nowadays selenium rc also getting deprecated selenium rc also getting deprecated using selenium rc also we can perform very limited testing so if we want to work with selenium rc we need to start the server manually and we need to stop the server manually that's the reason none of the people not using selenium rc also after that they made selenium web driver after that they made selenium web driver
Selenium web driver. What do you mean by Selenium web driver? Selenium web driver is nothing but it is a software which contains some set of programs. This set of programs we need to configure into one user interface. In the place of user interface, we are using Eclipse. We are using Eclipse. Eclipse is nothing but it is a powerful editor to write the Java programs. Both setups, RC setup and web driver setup, both are same. What is the main difference between Selenium RC and Selenium web driver? Whenever you are comparing with the Selenium RC, Selenium web driver having some powerful setup programs. Using this Selenium web driver, we can perform unlimited testing. And Selenium web driver is very, very user friendly. And without knowing anything, we can work with this Selenium web driver. That's the reason most of the people, most of the companies nowadays, they are encouraging only Selenium web driver. Using this Selenium web driver, we can perform unlimited testing. Okay, Selenium web driver is very, very user friendly. That is the reason most of the people nowadays they are choosing this Selenium web driver. So, first today concept is Selenium web driver. How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? So already we have Selenium web driver programs. This Selenium web driver programs we need to configure into one user interface. Already we know user interface that is Eclipse. So today first concept how to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? How to configure How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? How to configure Selenium web driver programs into programs into Eclipse? How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? So today, first concept to already we have Selenium web driver programs. So these web driver programs we need to configure into <coughs> Eclipse. So how to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? So Already I have Selenium web driver programs madam. This is the old version, old old Selenium web driver programs already I have. So this Selenium web driver programs we need to configure into Eclipse. Already I have 37 web driver programs, web driver program files. I have 37 web, web driver program files. This web driver program files we need to configure into Eclipse. How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? So go to Eclipse, open Eclipse, How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? Today, first concept how to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse. So, already I have Selenium web driver programs. So this web driver programs we need to configure into Eclipse. Now, this now I am opening only Eclipse. So Okay, this is Eclipse. How to configure Selenium web driver programs into Eclipse? Just right click, take the new project, select Java project, click on next. WD1, I am taking project name is WD1, click on finish. So just observe carefully madam. Right click on project. Just go to properties. Java build path. Libraries. Add external jars. Already have Selenium jars or web driver programs. Libraries. Control all. Click on open, click on OK. Go to SRC, take the new class. I taking class name is 
WD one 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 something. Keep the mark public static void mean. Click on finish. And taking one class. Okay. If you want to increase the size, so we can do Windows preferences general appearance color and fonts java color and fonts edit already it is 18 i'm keeping actually this, that is 10 so i'm keeping 18 so if you want to work with selenium web driver yesterday we learned one concept what is that concept if you want to learn selenium this is the only one line this is very very important i told you what is the line No. Interface name. Interface name. Interface name. Reference name. Equal to new class name. Only for this line we learn Java. Only for this line we learn Java. So here interface is web driver. Reference name WD equal to new firefox driver in the place of class i'm taking uh, firefox if you want to work with internet explorer driver just we can write internet explorer driver if you want to work with chrome driver just we can write chrome driver web driver wd equal new firefox driver after writing the code it will show you underlines so just keep the cursor and import statements just change to web driver what you open qs element firefox driver Change to Firefox driver or you open QS Linux. So if you want to work with any application, WD dot get HTTP. I want to work with Gmail dot com. I want to work with Gmail application. I want to work with Gmail application just keep semicolon enough we can open gmail page save click on run it will open the gmail page it is opened gmail page now I want to enter username and password. How to enter username and password? Observe carefully, madam. Wherever you go, if it is any application, each and every web application having one unique location. Each and every web element having one unique location. This is one web application, for example, Gmail. In the Gmail page, we have number of elements like username, password, something, button, edit box, combo box, list boxes, whatever it is. Any application having some web elements. So we need to find out the web elements. So these are the web elements. So each and every web element having one unique location. Each and every web element having one unique location. Each and every web element having one unique location. That's uni that unique location is nothing but X path. 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 So we need to find out the X path. We need to find out the X path. So how to find out the X path? Today concept. If we want to find out the X path compulsor, we need to have fire path. We need to have fire path. Fire path is nothing but it is a Order of it is the order of Firefox. Which is used for finding the X path. Okay, fire path is nothing but it is the order of Firefox which is used for finding the X path. So where we can get a fire path, we can get in fire bug. So what is fire bug? Fire bug also 
it is also add on of Firefox which is used for inspecting the web element inspecting the web element firebug is nothing but it is also add on of firefox which is used for inspecting the web element inspecting the web element so compulsor we need to download firepath and firebug how to download firebug and firepath now we can go to mozilla firefox go to google go to google just type here download firebug just type download firebug just click on uh, second link just click on second link come down and click on an older version click on an older version click on 1.9 click on 1.9.0 click on allow click on install now restart now it will install now we need to have fire path also just type download download fire path just click on first link download now R R add to Firefox click on allow it will install click on install now restart now yes now we have firebug and firepath so we can take the X path now Now, I want to work with the Gmail application. I want to work with Gmail application. system playing with me what happened to my system I have downloaded Firebug and Firepath made up. Just uh, I'm stopping the record mode made up. Just give me one minute time. Within one minute, I will call you made up once again.